What are you doing? Morning, everybody. Jason, PJ, Hollis Farms. Sun's coming up. Gonna be another scorcher today. I am steadily winding down these fire lanes that we gotta do. We got a pile of them. And we've done some new ones. We've been able to get to some stuff that we hadn't got to in the last year or so, maybe. Sometimes I forget something, but some of these trails and fire lanes that we don't use a lot. And the rhino has done great. That's been a great addition. I don't know why I hadn't done that before, but anyway, oh, about time to cut around the barn again, but I don't know if I'll do that today or not. I need, I might if it's dry enough. I don't want to make any ruts around the barn, but so we are winding down a lot of these fire lanes and, and all our main roads that we use most all deer season and turkey season i want to wait and get last minute because a lot of this stuff we have cut it's going to grow back some but uh the biggest reason i cut a lot of that is just to keep the fire lanes up to where when it's time to use them I ain't got to go on trees and all in because a lot of these trails we don't hardly ever use but if we do it's still not going to grow back too bad that it can't be used but the, my main stuff for deer hunting and where turkey, where turkey season, where I want it low enough where they can come in and feel comfortable walking and strutting, I'm gonna do that last. I ain't far from being, I've been seeing some of these fields that we sprayed uh, with the chemical. I may go ahead and cut them for long and then the stuff that we didn't spray, that'll be last. So just kind of, kind of pecking along, kind of pecking along, trying to get something done every day. I did get pictures of that group of hogs last night at the deer trough, quite right, but uh, they never did come under the trap. I may let that trough run out a day or two just to see if they'll go in there.
we graded I cut it pretty deep right up here and with the super grader there was so much stuff rolling over the back it got a little rough I'm going to go in here I like what it's doing I just need to go in here and lightly grade it to uh, kind of slick it back off I forgot to mention that big old moccasin a while ago. I just I should have went ahead and got him with the tractor real quick and I grabbed my phone out to video him. That was a big old song going. Wasn't just super long, but boy, he was big around. Them things will worry you. I always wonder if they'll climb up on the tractor. No telling how many we run over. PJ eating our little corn snack. We're gonna make us around. Got hot. Decided not to put any feed in that trough that's by the hog trap. See if we can get still corn there. I don't know. Some, some smart jokers, all I gotta say. They may have done seen some of the footage getting trapped. All right, y'all. So, not a bad day today. Another scorcher, though. Whew, it's hot. Had a pretty good day. Got some grass cutting done road grading done and another big old moxin up under the tractor i'll tell y'all what i have seen more big moxin this year than i ever have i'm gonna have to do like some people suggested and get me a scabbard <clears throat> put on the tractor so we can carry something with us to take care of them but i just hadn't done that yet anyway i'm gonna try to find a cool spot appreciate y'all watching out of here